right, so here we go. All right, so no button check. We're going to be going straight into it. Dark still starts off with a sweep on the overhead low. Nice walk back from Kelvin. Lands the back three. There we go. But drops the ender, though. Really good damage, though. That gave him a little bit of a life lead. Oh, good back range. Uh, excuse me. Good range on the back, too. Mm. Mm. And we have invulnerable wake up, so we don't care about your mix. That is a big beam, sir. All this and good looks, too. Nice, chases him in out of the air with the sword. Oh, misses meter burn it looked like. Trying to keep himself safe. Oh. Or clashing, I should say. Keep yourself safe. Dark still mashing out that reversal. Ooh! Trying to go for the dung beetle. Oh, punish. Uh, no punish from Kelvin. It's okay. Back three. Another back three. Ooh! Oh, was that going to hit? Oh! <laughs> Robin wins. Kelvin takes the first game. Begin. Very reminiscent of how the last game started. Dark Steel. Getting the first combo open. Good blocks. I love the sound effects on the metal sword, though. Pretty good. Meter burn rolls to get in, but they just die right past each other. Good blocks. That's still just kind of mashing his strings out right now. And that blue beetle tackle, very reminiscent of, uh, of Hawk Girl. Darksteel did used to play Hawk Girl in the first Injustice. This sweet. Punish. No, no punish. Oh, gets cracked with the overhead. Misses the back three. And a random back three from Darksteel. That ship? Yes. Lands the hit. There's the clash. Dark Steel with an early clash too. Could have probably taken some more some more damage before spinning his bar. Or spinning his clash has to say. Ooh, the whiff punch! Jumps. And Dark Steel now opting to go for the lame game. Just typically how it goes. Dark Steel starts losing in the in the up close range, so he starts playing more lame style. Ooh. Kelvin just trying to use all of his wake up options, and they're all landing nothing. Ugh. Then he gets tackled for his troubles. Dark still takes game number two. And an immediate rematch. And 
Kelvin just trying to work his way in. Finally gets his way in. Could have probably down too. Oh. Oh, that's still getting opened up in the corner. Oh! Woo! Completely crapped on in the corner. Meter burns. Star still not respecting it. It's a battering on the ground. Shit! Ooh, lands a back three. And Dark Steel not clashing. Holding on to the full stick of butter. Gets opened up again. And there's the clash. Called it a draw? Quit embarrassing yourself. Ooh, wake up assassin run? This man's living on the edge. Oh, there's the grab. Oh, that down two looks really bad. And again, with another wake up. Kelvin's got to try baiting those. Maybe a meter burn back three for the armor. Because it only hits once. Ah. Uh. There we go. Yep. This is what we've devolved to. There's a push block. Kelvin takes game number three. Begin. All right, we get the dung beetle. Back three, yes. Drops the ender though. Missed out on some really good damage. Oh, didn't convert into the string. Dark still finds the jump in. Yeah, Dark still just fishing for that overhead. Like he's just throwing it out there now. Oh. There's the wake up again. Overhead low, here we go. Spins the meter to get the life bar. This is still doable by Kelvin. Oh, meter burn rolls again, and I like it. Utilizing the tools of the game. Uh, not sure what that ender was, but he's all right. He's closing the gap on the life lead. Oh my god. The reel back on the forward three. And Kelvin clashes. He's going to be able to get 15% of his life back with this clash. Dark Steel realizing the situation that's at hand. He's one win away from, or excuse me, one round away from losing and being eliminated from this tournament. There's the, oh, there's the meter burn. A little too low to the ground. Missed the conversion. And Dark Steel once again creating more real estate. Oh, lands the jump in. Down one, there's a sweep, and there's a dung beetle. Uh, 
And it's now two to two. Begin. Last game of the set. Kelvin landing first blood here, getting the meter advantage. And positioning on the screen, but swap sides as soon as I say that. Ooh. And the zoning just too strong right now. Dark Steel just basically giving up on playing the close range game and just gonna adopt the zoning strategy here. Not punish. The inability to punish that uh, that shoulder tackle or the charge from Blue Beetle is being a real nuisance right now to Kelvin. So mash more down ones. Ooh! Kelvin, just look at the damage. And then we get the throw. First throw of the game. The pain isn't over yet. Oh, that's an overhead. Oh, excuse me, a mid. Bugging. Uh, this is Blue Beetle. Get it, bugging. Still walking up getting the punish. Ooh, Assassin's runs all the way in. Ooh, opens up Dark Steel. Oh no. Oh, Dark Steel get opened up again. Forces the clash. He can't save you. Alright, spins his resources. He's in! It's a knockdown. Does not respect the wake up though. Dark Steel's been waking up with it every time. Oh no! Oh, he teched out. Smart choice from Dark Steel, but Kelvin did not clash. Should have clashed there. Double meter burn roll. This is looking pretty grim right now. Yeah, there you have it. 